All right. So first and foremost, we're gonna give our praises to Yahweh, Ba'asham, Yahushai, Ba'asham, Rakai Kodash. We see double on the apostles and elders are great, most honored well. Um, we say salutations to the Akimos, the pushing would not return to the Dean and the Alton of Continuing Season on Season. We say Shallow One. You know, once again, we're going to a video here. Um, this was uploaded by a brother, you know, about a, 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 a big chariot, you know, which, which you will, which you will, you know, um, call so called a um, UFO, right? What they call a UFO, flying saucer, you know, but which, which, when they go into the scriptures is actually the chariots of the Lord, right? And this particular, this particular video is someone, um, someone, um, um, seen a big one, you know, on a, on a, on a footage, right? Um, I will display how piece of the video and continue. Right, so you see, as you can hear the person say that it's it big, you know, and before I continue, you know, if you, if you hear any noise in the background and, you know, any particular, particular noise, it's just work doing any background, right? Um, so, you know, I just want to go open with a scripture here. This is, um, this is Revelation chapter 1 verse 7, because you can hear you say it was big. And what comes to mind when you see the word, how big it was, he never saw this, is how the scripture says that when the Lord come back. How every eye, how, how every eye shall see him, you know. Okay, and first, you know, plain people think the Lord come back with a white horse, a horse with wings. You know that that Pegasus doctrine, you know that Greek mythology, right? But really and truly, the Lord come back with with the chariots, which you will call a UFO, right? So this is Revelation chapter one verse seven. It says, "Behold, he coming with clouds, and every eye shall see him." And the clouds there is actually for the 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 chariots, right? actually for the ufos right so he said behold he come with clouds and every eye shall see him and they also which pierce him and all the kingdoms of the earth shall will because of him so it just to show you like when you see when you see that and it can hear it in your voice how how he was shocked you know like some kind of way some emotion that how it was so big you know and that will come to my mind is that hey when the lord come back with with all those chariots and all these things right all those chariots to cover this place Right? Because, hey, this place is going to turn dark. The sun going to be, the sun going to be um, covered because the size of those chariots are, that be coming. So that is why the scripture says, Behold, he coming with clothes and every eye shall see him. You can't miss. As I can hear this person say, so it's it big, you know? It's huge. Say, every eye shall see him and they also which pierce him and all the kingdoms of the earth shall wail because of him. So yeah. Every eye going, every eye going and see him. Cause this, this, that child gonna be big. You understand? And hey, just in the clipping, as you, you even see it in the clipping, where you see how big it was and how it was moving through space. And and just imagine countless thousands more more of that. You understand? We jump to our next scripture here. This is um, Zechariah chapter five, or start from verse one. It said, then I turned and lifted up my eyes, and behold, and no, Salah. Then I turned and lifted up my eyes, and look, and behold, a flying roll, right? As I said before, they like to say flying saucer, but the scripture say well, a flying roll. And this is say plenty, plenty of these, these churches, these Christians, these Catholics, these Jehovah's Witness. If you ask them about that, if you ask them, hey, I see, a, a, I see something flying through the sky, where it is, they can't answer it. They cannot give you that, that breakdown. They can't say, well, hey, the written in the scriptures is that is the child of the Lord. You know? And, it, and, and the thing about it is that it's right here. It says, then I turned and looked and lifted up my eyes and looked and behold a flying roll. So when you look up, you see it. You see the flying roll. You know? You see that circle spinning. Right? You see, and he said unto me, what seest thou? And I answered, I answered, and I answered, I see in a flying roll, 
the length thereof is 20 cubits and the breadth thereof 10 cubits. So the distance you see in the rule from, that was the measurement you see it, right? Um, you see, then said he unto me, this is the curse that goeth forth over the face of the whole earth. Yeah, because when this thing cover, the, the, remember when, when, the, when the Lord come up with this chariot, the things he come in to do is not just love. He come in to destroy, come out with fire, he come in to shoot, shoot those, those, those lasers, shoot, 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 um, shoot those chariots, right? So you see, then, then said he unto me, this is a curse that will fall over the face of the whole earth. For everyone that steal it shall be cut off as on this side according to it. And everyone that swear it shall be cut off as on that side according to it. So yeah. So yeah. So, hey, these the, the chariots, the things that you're, the, hey, and it, it, it's countless of, of chariots being, being arms, being seen, you know. I, I saw one brother put up chariots, so much chariots in the daytime. I saw next one pop chariots in the nighttime. I myself saw, you know, saw plenty going through the sky. Some going slow cruising and then shoot off, you know, super, supersonic speed, right? Hey, hey, and, and watching this video and seeing, seeing the size, hey, you get to understand that the Lord really said that all I shall see. All I shall see, right? So let's read him up from verse 2. It says, And he said unto me, What seest thou? And I answered, I see in a flying roll. The Mr. Dabba from verse 1, he said, Then I turned and lifted up my eyes and looked, and behold, a flying roll. So just, just like how you, you, you could be walking him and look up in the sky and you see it. He said, May he did. Right? He said, And he said unto me, What seest thou? And I answered, I see, I see a flying roll. The length thereof is 20 cubits, and the breadth thereof is of the breadth thereof 10 cubits. So, Hey, just like when you see it, I might say, where's the measurement? And you know, you give my a description, you know? Hey, this, you know? <laughs> and he said, then said he unto me, this is a curse that goeth forth over the face of the whole earth. For everyone that steal it shall be cut off and as on this side according to it. And everyone that swear it shall be cut off as on, as on that side according to it. So yeah, so remember, even when this come, you see it in the movies that, that the, the white man doesn't want to fight, to fight and fight with the UFOs, right? If, and in the movies, what they're what they, what they showing you is, is, is scriptures because at the end, when the Lord come back, they, they would want to fight him. You know, but it dies when the Lord come back with, with, with his machine. The curse. You know, what, what a simple tank, a simple what the things they have. The Lord, the Lord technology way beyond their comparison. Right? Um, jump to the next scripture here. This is Isaiah 66. Jump to verse 15. Right? It's it for behold. For behold, the Lord will come with fire and with his chariots like a whirlwind to render his anger with fury and his rebuke with flames of fire. So yeah, so the Lord will come with fire and his chariots like a whirlwind. You know, plenty of times you come to this time, you see, you see, you see your foes, how they just be spinning and so forth. Playing with the clouds, you know. It are it pictures where the, chari the chariots are going through the clouds and, and turning it up. Right? Turning it up. I myself saw a chariot going... The clothes is going down, like the clothes is going. Um, let me just say, let me just give you a call and it's like, let, let me just say, the the the, the clothes is going so, um, south west side, and the chariot was going, the chariot was big and going through the clouds, actually turning the clouds going towards the the um north side, right? <laughs> and uh, hey. This you chair, hey, this chair, these things that we call you your first day. The Lord technology really different. The Lord creation really different, you know. So he said, For behold, the Lord will come with fire and with a chariot like a whirlwind to render his anger with fury. So, yeah, so when them all eyes won't see him, hey, <laughs> it's just no his judgment. So he said, Render his anger with fury and his rebuke with flames of fire. So, yeah. The Lord can come into play with the chariots. The scriptures talk about the beams coming out from it, from the mouth of it, right? You know, and hey, I will do a part two to this video. But hey, this was just some script I want to touch upon this. So just to show you how, hey, all eyes really want to see, see that. You can see how big it is. In the video, you see how big it is, you know? So with that, we give our praises to Yahweh, Ba'ashem, Yahushai, Ba'ashem, Rakakodash. We say double answer that pastors and elders are great, Mr. Well, and salutations holy. I came out to the push you with no truth and say the day and the out. You know, constantly in season and season, we say, shallow one.